Good day, mate. Unraveling Aussie colloquial grammar. Good day, learners. Today, we're diving deep into the heart of Australia to explore some of the most common colloquial grammar constructions in Australian English. Australian English is a unique blend of phrases, words, and grammar rules, often leaving those unfamiliar with it a tad bewildered. So, let's embark on this exciting linguistic journey together. One of the first colloquialisms you'll notice in Australian English is the shortening of phrases. Going to often becomes gonna. I'm going to the beach becomes I'm gonna go to the beach. This isn't unique to Australia, but you'll certainly hear it frequently down under. Australians often add, hey, at the end of statements, converting them into informal questions. It's a hot day. Hey? It's a way to seek agreement or a response from the listener. In Australian English, sometimes sentences are ended with, but, without any continuation. It's used for emphasis or to indicate a contrast. I wanted to join the party, but this might sound incomplete, but it's a natural way Aussies express themselves. Australians might use think, followed by an infinitive verb form, which can seem unusual to other English speakers. I think go there tomorrow instead of I think I'll go there tomorrow. It's a quicker, more casual way to express future plans or intentions. The term reckon is widely used in Australian English as an informal replacement for think or believe. I reckon it's going to rain today. If someone asks for your opinion, don't be surprised if you're asked. What do you reckon? And there we have it, mates. A quick trip through some of the colloquial grammar constructions you'll encounter in the land of kangaroos and koalas. Australian English is vibrant, evolving, and deeply rooted in the country's rich history and culture. I hope you found this insight into Aussie colloquialisms useful. Remember, language isn't just about grammar and vocabulary. It's also about embracing the culture and spirit behind the words. So, keep practicing and, as the Aussies say, no worries. Catch you in the next video.